F-22 in Europe lands at Fort Drum, new breakthroughs in rapid refueling and combat flexibility. In early July 2024, the United States Air Force recorded a historic milestone with the first landing of an F-22 Raptor fighter at Fort Drum Airfield. The move marks a significant achievement in operational efficiency and rapid refueling capabilities for this fifth-generation fighter. Fort Drum, located in upstate New York, is known as the headquarters of the 10th Armored Division. The airfield at the base was originally designed to support large-scale military operations, but the arrival of the F-22 Raptor brought a new dimension to the facility. This first landing is part of a U.S. Air Force initiative to test and improve logistics capabilities and operational readiness in smaller locations. Up until now, F-22s have often relied on larger main bases for their operations, so this landing is a step forward in expanding combat range and flexibility. The rapid refueling process at this airfield involves advanced technology that allows the F-22 to refuel in a very short time. This is a crucial feature, especially in combat situations where time is a very important factor. This rapid refueling technology involves the use of devices that can deliver fuel at a high rate without significantly disrupting aircraft operations. This process requires precise coordination between the ground crew and the pilot to ensure that everything runs smoothly. The F-22 Raptor, known for its stealth and air superiority capabilities, utilizes rapid refueling to maximize operational time in the air. This provides a significant strategic advantage in situations where speed and effectiveness are key. The landing at Fort Drum also demonstrates the readiness and flexibility of the U.S. Air Force in adapting their operations across multiple locations. This is not just about logistical efficiency, but also about the ability to conduct force projection in areas that may not have major infrastructure. From a technical standpoint, this landing involved extensive planning and training. Pilots and ground personnel undergo simulations and drills to ensure that every step is performed accurately. This is important to avoid potential mistakes in a complex operation like this. Fort Drum Airfield is designed to accommodate various types of aircraft, but the F-22 landing adds a new dimension in terms of operations and capacity.
This required adjustments in refueling procedures as well as other logistical arrangements. The success of this first landing also reflects technological achievements and innovations in military aviation. Efficient refueling technology allows aircraft like the F-22 to operate more effectively in a variety of scenarios. This will hopefully serve as a model for future military operations, especially in areas that lack major support facilities. With the ability to conduct rapid refueling, the U.S. Air Force can maintain their presence and combat power across multiple locations. Fort Drum not only serves as the headquarters of the 10th Armored Division, but is also now a strategic location for the testing and application of advanced technologies. This landing demonstrates how military facilities can evolve with changing operational needs. Military experts are closely watching how this landing affects combat strategy and tactics. With the ability to refuel quickly in smaller locations, the U.S. Air Force can respond to threats with more agility. It also confirms the U.S. Air Force's commitment to expanding their operational reach. Fort Drum is now a living example of how existing infrastructure can be optimized to support the latest fighter technology. The F-22 landing at Fort Drum is another example of how innovations in military technology and operations are constantly evolving. It's not just about aircraft technology, but also about how ground facilities adapt to meet new demands.
With this success, the U.S. Air Force plans to continue testing and evaluation at Fort Drum and other locations.